Hi, are you an artist who likes to experiment and likes to live um, slightly on the dangerous side? You might love ink resist technique. My name's Liz Chatterton. I'm a watercolour artist based in Berkshire and I'm just launching a new course which is all about ink resist technique. Now it is dangerous because at some point you're going to paint over your entire picture with black Indian ink before washing it off under a tap to reveal the final image. And the images that you achieve through this technique look like vintage lino prints or woodblock prints. You can see a couple of my Ridgeway series behind me. So in the course I'll introduce the technique to you and the whole process. We'll do a little warm up to make sure that all our materials are up to the job and then we'll go step by step through a landscape. I've selected this landscape which is the Ridgeway path that goes through the Chilterns. It's well, thousands of years old, goes up to um, Hill Fort and the White Horse that you can see behind me past Wayland Smithy, Long Barrow, um, beautiful place and I think that this ink resist technique is brilliant for capturing the, the age of the place. But ink resist is fabulous for buildings, for faces, still life. It's a really, really exciting way of working. I thought I'd show you how it actually works. So you paint in gouache, leaving the bare paper to accept the ink, cover it in ink, dry it, and then wash it off under running water with a, a good brush to sort of scrub off the ink. And the ink sticks to the bare paper, but where the gouache is, it washes away and you end up with this beautiful sort of black outline and faded glory of the half washed away gouache. Um, once it's dry after this washing off, you can actually touch up any ink and watercolour that you need to. So um, I take you through the whole process and show you how to do that and how to make any changes that you need. I absolutely love it. It's a really exciting technique. It's quite dramatic. It's quite scary, uh, but the results are brilliant and a little unpredictable, which is what I love. So if you've seen this technique in a book and thought, hmm, I'll have a go at that one day, now's the time. You can sign up at www.lizchatterton.studio.co.uk and I hope to see you there.